good. Uh, you did choose to go that direction, but the ones that you did adopt were basically saying that we're going to allow the people of the city to, um, we're going to maintain as much services and amenities as we can for the people of the city. With regard to this arboration, arboretum fee, the same exact arguments were made about the Japanese tea garden. And what happened over time was that inevitably the residence fee came in, then the free time was, was reduced, and then the free time was virtually eliminated. So that the Japanese tea garden has now become a place for tourists. It's no longer a place for the city and a place for the people of the city. It's been denied us. And so what you're doing by instituting this fee is heading down the road of taking a service away, not preserving a service. You're taking something that's very precious to a lot of people. And I mean precious. I mean, most people, that, a lot of people that come in there say, oh, my son grew up here. Oh, I brought my family here. They, we, we used to come here every Sunday. Uh, uh, you, know, you just you would not believe the number of people who love that place, who have a, a place of respite where they can go and read a book in, in peace at a bunch bench by some place that's slight secluded, um, a place of, of where people spend money to put benches in, in, in memory of their loved ones who they used to enjoy the arboretum with. Um, that, don't take that away from us. It's, it's not going to solve anything. It's going to, just going to add to the problem. It's just going to take something away from people. It's not going to add anything. It's not going to preserve anything. It's just going to take away. That's my, that's my true feeling about this. Thank, Thank you. you.